Hi everyone! I'm so happy to have Anne with us today. Anne has been a member of CD Harvest since 2012. When I first met her and heard of her story, I was so touched by her faith and courage. Anne, please introduce yourself and give us a little bit of your family background. Hi, I'm Anne. Uh, I came from Malaysia and uh, I married with my husband in the year 2000. We have the two boys. The elder is Oscar and the second child is uh, Sujin. When Sujin was uh, born, he was uh, diagnosed with a Down syndrome. When Sujin was nine months old, uh, my husband was diagnosed with uh, leukemia. And after that, uh, he was passed away when my elder is three and a half years and Sujin is 18 months. That actually, when your husband passed away, the doctors told you Sujin needed to go for an emergency operation. Yeah, I still remember when the time after my husband passed away, out from the funeral, and then I go to another ICU. When the time my son was a uh, heart have the hole and um, he have uh, unwell, so we sent him to hospital check, and doctor was told me that it's a uh, it's an urgent case, he have to operate in a immediate times. So um, when the time I really beyond my control and I really don't know what I can do on that so I just keep on to pray when I pray and God uh, give me the verses it's uh, Ezekiel uh, 36 he say he will give Sujin is a new heart so um, he is a faithful God and he is a um, keep his promise and after a few years Sujin go back to hospital to check up his heart so um, doctor was told me yeah he really recover in a very well and really like a new heart for him. Wow, that was just so awesome. So God spoke to you from Ezekiel 36 verse 26 that I will give you a new heart, a new spirit I'll put within you. And I think and God performed such an amazing miracle for you and for Sujin. I think that must have been really difficult for you to have lost a husband and be left with two young children. So and could you tell us what kept you going? through those difficult times? When I'm going to the difficult times, uh, I will keep on to pray because uh, by His grace, so really uh, Christ is uh, pushed me on to the forward and His grace is always enough for me. How was it like bringing up two boys by yourself? Did you have any support? Uh, by His grace, that is uh, uh, always enough for me. Like all those years, uh, 我们也没有借,也没有欠,他的恩典是够我们用了。When they are young, there will be more difficult. My work time and how to find a school for Sujun, take care of them with the single working mom. 当我遇到困难的时候,很多时候我在晚上都会私底下的自己在哭。毕竟我不想让孩子们看到我在哭而来而影响到他们嗯很好的是隔一天我就会面对着镜子告诉自己说你是可以的因着他的恩典他是够你用的然后我就会收拾我的心情然后再继续去面对每一天需要做的事情God
，我既然可以把他带到今天，他告诉我他要去当兵了。所以在整个过程中，我很感谢我自己当初没有放弃，没有随意的放弃。所以我写，我也想告诉大家说，不要随意的放弃。只要你，在我的人生里面，我是祷告支撑着我去过每一个人生，每一个难关。所以我也是想告诉大家说，只要你不放弃，你后面的成果还是你可以看到的。Thank you so much, Anne, for sharing with us. Your wonderful story. I'm just really so deeply touched. So we want to encourage everyone. No matter what happens, don't give up. Trust and believe that God is with you.